Hello, I'm Dr. Is Garcia. I'm an emergency medicine physician, and with temperatures heating up in South Florida, now is a good time to review heat exhaustion, heat stroke, and how to prevent this from occurring. Heat exhaustion occurs when the body is overheating and is still able to cool itself down. This causes symptoms such as sweating, dizziness or lightheadedness, headache, nausea, and cramps. If you feel this coming on, you need to stop what you're doing and get yourself into the shade or into some air conditioning, drink cool water, and get some rest. Allowing your body to cool down is key in preventing progression to heat stroke. Now, heat stroke is a true medical emergency. This occurs when the body can no longer cool itself. And at this point, the body will reach core temperatures of 103 degrees or higher. The body will also stop sweating and confusion, fainting and seizure can also occur. If you were with someone that is confused, stops sweating or collapses in the heat, call 911 immediately. You can also move them into the shade or into a cooler area and start the cooling process with some ice packs, cold water, and fans. Thankfully, heat illnesses are preventable, and we can do this by staying hydrated, wearing light-colored clothing, and taking frequent breaks in the shade. Hope this helps.